Hi, today I'm just going to show you a few things I've gotten in the mail, a few books from some authors and a couple things I ordered. Um, and let's get started. The first thing I ordered was a Throne of Glass phone holder. Let's see? I love it. It's so nice but it came in the wrong size and I've been trying to get in touch with them because they sent no information to send me the raw right size and they are not responding so we'll figure something out okay that's the first thing the second thing is these lovely bookmarks I got from Till and Dill. And even back of the thing says Handle with Love. I thought it was so cute. Sent me a letter saying thank you so much for buying our bookmarks. We hope that you had liked them and make sure to write a review. Don't worry about that. I will definitely write a review. They are beautiful. Have a lovely day. Lots of love, Till and Dill. Look at those beautiful bookmarks. I mean, they're just gorgeous. Beautiful. They're the prettiest ones I have owned yet. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Thank you, Till and Dill, and I will definitely write a review. Okay, now, the first book that I got from an author is by Lana Campbell called Forever in a Night. It is a vampire story. It is about a, um, a woman who makes a man a vampire and she treats him really horridly and she finally lets go of him and he makes something of himself and makes himself into a very rich person. Well, when she finds that out, she wants a part of his life. She doesn't want love, she wants to marry him. And um, he doesn't want nothing to do with her. He gets enchanted with a woman that he meets at a restaurant that he visits one night. And he makes her his personal chef by glamorizing her, basically. And um, he is afraid that if he tells her what he is, who he is, that she won't want to stay with him. So that's what this is about. And I will definitely give it a shot and um, uh, write a review and put a review up here and let you know how it is. Thank you, Miss Campbell. Okay. Next thing I got today by Vista Clara Productions. The Book of Kringle. I can't I don't know if you can see how beautiful that is. It's like leather. It is beautiful. There's some business cards in there. But the artwork is just gorgeous. Just so pretty. It's like that on every page. Every page. Beautiful book. And I'm going to write a review on that. And they also gave me a coloring book. I like that since I'm into coloring. And my granddaughter. This is something I can do with my granddaughter. And um, she's only three, but she'll get to where she can do the activities later on. Thank you, Vista Clara. And I will definitely write a review on this. And thank you very much. Okay. Let's see, the next one is Eternal Darkness by L.F. Johns. 
a gift for you. Hi Renee, hope you enjoy the book from Jasmine. It is about humans and cyborgs. Um, Scarlet, a young girl, is neither, but she is a soldier created to kill on command, but her memory has been erased. Um, the world is dangerous. With the help of a group of cyborgs, Scarlet will fight to uncover the truth and transform the future of the new world she now lives in. That sounds very interesting. Thank you, Jasmine. I will definitely read that and put a review up. Thank you very much. I'm looking forward to that. Okay, my next book is by Samuel Bavley. The Secret of the Sphinx. It is about a long time ago, an evil sorcerer captures Ned, the king's magician, and puts his soul in a stone sphinx. A 14-year-old boy is visiting a museum on a class trip, and, and um, he senses that somehow this boy is the, gaining, is the key to gaining his freedom and somehow he reaches into Neb and well it sounds good it sounds interesting actually you should look this up it's a very short story it shouldn't take me long at all to read this and I will definitely write a review he's asking me to write a review um, on Amazon and I definitely will and I'll put a little review up here too and that's all the stuff I have, but I'm still reading The Progeny. Um, I'm halfway through, but I thought that tomorrow I would put a video up about A Court of Thorns and Roses, my review on that. And um, I love this book. I love the second one better, but I love this book. It was both so good. And I know a lot of y'all agree with me about that. And I will do that tomorrow, and that way I'll have a couple videos up, and y'all won't have to just look at my intro video. That is kind of embarrassing. But um, I appreciate y'all for watching, and I will get better. I'm just a little bit nervous right now, and over time, I, I know I'll get better. Thank you for watching. Have a good day.